Hey guys, Ishma here, and uh, welcome back to 13 Sentinels Aegis Dream. Now, it hasn't been long since we streamed the last time, it's only actually been a couple hours, but uh, in the words of the wise Sheldon Cooper, I don't need sleep, I need answers. I mean, <laughs> there have been some pretty juicy plot bombs been dropped on us at the end of the last one, the last stream that is. And, uh, yeah, speculation is running wild in my mind. And I kind of want to see what that is all about. But I guess before we start uh, talking about the story, why don't we start this stream off with a little bit of action? Because, you know, we haven't done a lot of battles during the last stream. I think only one, actually. So, um, I'm itching for some hot robot action here. So, yeah, we only got an A rank on the last battle, which is pretty sad, but let's check out the next one. Maximum four strike team members, Amiguchi on the strike team. Uh, but we can't have that. Because he's overloaded. I guess this might be actually our perfect opportunity to just go back and retry this battle, because he will have recovered at the end of it. And then we can clear the optional objective here. So let's do that. It's actually the first time that we replay one of the battles. So let's see. So we still need Takamiya once more. Mm, but who else are we going to take then? Who else indeed? Maybe we should actually bring Megumi, and that means Kisaragi. And then Kurabe. And maybe actually her again. Yori. Yeah, I think that looks good. So we have a shitload of meta chips at the moment because we did so much story yesterday. So why don't we actually go ahead and upgrade our meta systems? And of course our chip multiplier. And maybe even go ahead and upgrade that further yet. This is starting to get quite expensive. can't quite reach the maximum multiplier, but we do have our meta system maxed at least. I guess we can do that next time. Let's actually take a look at who we bring into battle and how we can upgrade them. Ah, would love to have that. But yeah, nothing we could have done about that. Let's go ahead and upgrade some of the other stuff then. Uh, definitely want to upgrade these. Because they will come quite in handy in this battle. Oh yeah, we can also get these now if we would have the chips for it. All these upgrades are getting quite expensive. Well, these could be good. Oh, I actually have them, why didn't I upgrade them? Or oh, equip them rather. Let's 
This could actually also be quite effective. Mm. I mean, these things are quite lethal as well. Oh yeah, we definitely need that on him. And there we go. I don't think we actually need that for this battle. So let me switch that around. Yeah, we are basically out of chips at this point, so... I like it. Let's try. See if you all finally managed to get an S rank here. Just take a moment to appreciate the music in this game. Because it's freaking amazing. As always, I want to first pull up down my sentry guns here. And then let's start taking out some workers. as many of these workers as possible as soon as possible. Tomi should be able to handle that, so Megumi can come over here. Check out these enemies. Yeah, he can go and leap right into the fray, actually. Oh no, it's okay, I can hit them as well. Clear the area around him. Uh, actually, I oh, survived. Okay, you gotta get out of there. Um, gonna actually place down another sentry gun. And while we're at it, go ahead and deploy these. With 
perk. Go and get rid of them. Okay, I think these kaiju just landed. So let's immediately get rid of them. And you just... Well, actually... I think just the leap attack will be enough here. Alright, are there any other small fry? Yeah, they're over there. This might be overkill, actually. Let's just destroy them like this. Oh, okay. Those are you now. Okay. Just gotta get to the front of that. I guess it's third time to shine then. Gotta save A. Rid of all these workers. Because while these workers don't deal a lot of damage, I mean, if you're just surrounded by a thousand of them, they are still going to hurt. Keeping things under control somewhere here. Oh, we are not out of the woodwork yet. Definitely gotta get rid of, rid of these mines. You actually have to retreat just a little bit to get out of range of those guys. You should be fine up here. Because I don't want you in the middle of all of that. I just noticed that you can zoom the map. <laughs> they win. Um, no, just wait for now. Okay, you are the big guys. Especially who we've been waiting for. They got those. Now I've moved him too far back. Maybe not. Oh, yeah. Okay, what are we gonna do with her? 
A lot of workers over there. Oh yeah, can't do anything else but do this anyway. So I might as well get rid of him. She's also out of juice. So let's help A. Our biggest target here. How will I deal the most damage with that? Oh, these guys are here now. Do I shoot that or do I get rid of all the workers? We could just get, get rid of all these small fry. So all sentry guns and stuff actually focus on the big guys. guys I never really want to have him jump into all of that again but if he clears out all of these he should be able to take it especially if she can come over and clear most of them Okay. I think we're starting to get in control of this. I need just have to slowly make his way over to the big guy. What's it called again? Twin tail? No. Aqua. She's out of juice yet again. Just about cleared all of it. So now it's only time to get rid of all these small fry. Right, you actually start moving over there now. Tackle the big dude. Just shot my sentry cannon, which I'm totally okay with. As long as he's not shooting us. It's no problem at all. Yeah. Let's put the big girl up now. So I'm piercing on these as well. Alright, everyone, focus on him. Woo, okay, did it. This battle is actually kind of tough. Hey, there, Anakin. How are you doing, man? I mean, you know, it only says that you are fighting a horde of workers here, but 
with this many targets on the battlefield, it's actually really hard to focus. Oh, hey! Washek's here too, sorry! Oh, I totally miss you guys. I was just so concentrated on not messing this up again. <laughs> because I do want to get my S rank. Sorry, sorry. Ah, so I guess, once we know our result here, it's time uh, to have a little, I don't know, talk about what's been going on in the story so far. Because, yeah, I've been playing until pretty late night yesterday, and there have been quite the revelations. Right. S rank. S rank. Come on, I need an S to feel good. Yo, Yori was even the MVP here. Project everyone. It's not like that. What is not like what? So many enemies here. Shit. Should be an Azerang, right? There we go! Alright, that makes me feel better. Ah, uh, not just yet. So! <laughs> Story time, guys. Story time. So, there have been some big truth bombs been dropped on us yesterday um where do we even start so i guess besides time travel you know the general science fiction story of the game anyway uh the androids um that were introduced uh the magic guns nano machines the amnesia, the sentinels. Uh, we have also now discovered that these nano machines actually let you download the memories of other people and that you can actually um, transfer your consciousness into another body via the nano machines. So we are now at the point where you can't even trust anybody anymore to actually be the person that they, well, should be, so to say. <laughs> Which, you know, complicates matters a little bit further. Also, I can't quite remember anymore where it was. Oh yeah, it was in Keitaro's story, I believe. You know, he noticed that the dent that his little sister made in the house wasn't actually there anymore when he visited Juro's house in 1985. And then we heard a transmission about a lady talking to the Keitaro in the future, you know, in 2188, about remodeling her house on one of these colonies that they are trying to erect in space. And that coupled with a few other things make me actually believe that forget all the time travel shenanigans we have never ever been time traveling what we actually did was we are actually traveling via the gates between different colonies in space like I don't know if it's the same colony or if they're separated by some kind because what we also found out when we played as Shu, was that the whole world is only the city we live in. You cannot leave the city. If you want to leave the city via one of the tunnels, actually your brain just gets uh, some memories implanted of what you've been doing outside the city, but you never left the city. There is no outside. The whole world is just that one dome uh, in the city. I can I can show that. Wait, it's one of the, it's in one of the mystery files here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Somewhere down below here. This! 
giant dome with a diameter of 30 kilometers holds an urban structure with Ashitaba city as its center. You know, Ashitaba is the city we've been in the whole time. The world doesn't exist past the 30 kilometer boundary and whoever steps past the residential zone gets false memories implanted, making them believe that the world continues on as normal. Which absolutely make me believe that we are in one of these space colonies and that basically we have, you know, one of these domes for the city of 1985 we have another dome for the city of 1945, yet another dome for the city of 2025, and so on and so forth. And all what these gates allow us to do is travel between these different domes. Which also makes sense when the Daimos attack, because they are just attacking all of these domes at once, you know, to get rid of the human colonies. Because, yet again, with Ryoko, we have learned that in a footage from 2188 she was heartbroken because Tetsuya Ida was just using her. She loses all of her humanity and alters Project Arc, which I believe to be this space colonization thing, so that they have a machinery that was actually trying to terraform the other planets would uh, trigger at a certain point in time and just go on ahead and you know, destroy the colonies to basically eradicate humankind. Now, I don't know what exactly they mean by a never-ending loop. Like, is the production of these space colonies somehow automated that, you know, every few years another colony gets constructed on its own somehow? Loaded up with clones, because, you know, that is also a thing in this game, who get uh, translated some memories of their past selves. And they'll just live out their lives, maybe not even knowing it. Because what this would basically mean is that we eradicate the whole concept of time in this type of game. You know, we could be, you know, thousands of years in the future and people just haven't noticed. You know, we could be in the year 5000 for all I care at this point. It's just that some people have basically awoken to their past memories. Because what, you know, we thought were the dreams of Juro, Yori and Shu aren't actually of future events, you know, in the year 2188. They are way in the past, and that is why they are memories. They are remembering their past selves, not something from their future selves or future personalities or whatever. <laughs> also, what is interesting, remember that this city dome is 30 uh, kilometers in diameter? Well, lo and behold, that UFO that the cities are built on has also a diameter of 30 kilometers. Which means that the whole ground of the, the whole underground of the city is basically that UFO. Which further leaves me to believe that that UFO is actually, you know, just the mainframe of the space colony that we are on. It's not a UFO. It's, you know, just the space colony that the city dome has been built upon. And at some point they said that this UFO is ancient, you know, maybe millions of years old or something. Which reinforces my point that we are actually way in the future, you know, way past 2188. I don't know how much, maybe it will be said later on, but um, yeah, basically what we found out yesterday, you know, see, this is one of the colonies, colony under construction up in a satellite orbiting Earth in 2187. Once completed, it had a diameter of 30 kilometers, yet again, and was docked with multiple giant cylindrical food production silos. I mean, you know, these three things here, the UFO with a diameter of 30 kilometers, the city dome with a diameter of 30 kilometers, and this colony in satellite orbit with yet again a diameter of 30 kilometers, that can't be coincidence. I mean, come on. <laughs> really? Do you things with the same diameter? No. No, 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 no. <laughs> There's something going on here. Um. Yeah, you know. This is all going downhill, but, uh. I think we are starting to really get closer to the truth here. And it has me really. I mean, I. I don't know if I even slept tonight, <laughs> because I was so anxious. 
<laughs> to dive back in and get this going again <laughs> to see what would happen. Um, yeah, man, this is a wild ride. Like, I can just imagine the writer of the story sitting there and his brain basically goes, so... Which science, science fiction themes do you want in this story? And he just goes, yes. <laughs> because, you know, there's just like everything in here. You know, like, you know, we have the giant robots. We have the, well, quote unquote time travel, I want to say. We have these space colonies. We have this attacking enemy force that's destroying mankind. Mankind, mankind is politically eradicated. We have clones. We have uh, nanomachines, we have mind and brain jacking, we have transporting personalities across people, we have androids. I don't know, man. It's basically everything in there, somehow, in one form or another. So, <laughs> yeah. Alright. <sighs> yeah, I just had to get that off my chest. Let's see if any of this comes actually true or not. But I'm pretty sure. Also, yeah. We now have all of the 13 characters to play as, um, however, <laughs> you know, we just played the prologue with Renya, but we get so much information out of that, that the game is just like, nope, you gotta get all the other characters over 80% story completion before you are allowed to play with him again. <laughs> because he really is the character that digs up the whole truth bombs, like, every scene with him was just... Bum, 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 bum. Truth, 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 truth. <sighs> I'm excited. I really am. Alright, guys. Let's actually go ahead and uh, jump back in. Why don't we start with Takatoshi, who has been bound by... Oh, God, I always forget the little bugger's name. It's Okina, I think. But what the hell is his... Uh, Actual name again. Where is he? Tsukasa. Tsukisa Okino. I always call him Okani. I don't know why. Tsukasa. Right. Takatoshi has been bound to a chair by Tsukasa, and he was actually trying to read out his mind or something, his thoughts and memories. So let's see what came of that. Yep. Still. Imprisoned here, I guess. Well, maybe not. Ah. Probably wiped his memory. How often has he done this now? ここから学校まで歩けば昼には着くだろう今は少しでも節約しなければ。ああ、バックとスクール。なるほど。大きなの言う通り、今封鎖された旧教員玄関なら誰にも会わずに侵入できるようだ。さて、大きなはどこだ
慎太郎が食べ終わったら慎太郎片付けてくれないか慎太郎その子の名前だよ頼んだからねおやきすぽしゅうえいとだいえぽいあいねこかんのしたになにかあるぞこれは百五十円おきのもしやきさまおれのためにえいわかんまにあいんかのわつくんとはぱんな。We're going to get some drink here. Oh, look, it's Mori Moore. Oh, to. I know you say what got going to kill me. Oh, can I watch you? Oh, yeah. Also, I totally forgot to tell you guys what also happened is we found out who prisoner 426 is. You know, the one that Ryoko is trying uh, to arrest. It's actually Yuro Izumi. You know, the adult Euro who is actually trying to sabotage the Sentinels, or actually did sabotage the Sentinels in 2025, so they couldn't fight. And he is actually the AI that is controlling the Tomi android, because he switched places with her when Tetsuya Ida wasn't looking in his lap. And don't worry if you don't understand any of this. <laughs> we'll get to it eventually. Yakisobapan <laughs> Angel. It's all a bit about puberty. That is when he was first transported here. Okay. 
すぎちゃって焼きそばパンですがおお焼きそばパンいただけるんですかよければどうぞい,いただきます焼きそばパン<笑>うまいこんなうまい食い物がこの世にあっていいのか Well, I guess if you haven't eaten anything in a few days, kind of to be expected. Yakisoba Pan Angel. Okay. ごろのこないだな。どこにいるのかと思えば。ハロービヘイビア。それを買いに行ってたのか大きいの。カマンドゥ、レッツイートファースト。それでは。いただくとするか。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。う
Gonna get shot, dude. And she's also going to go and shoot Ninji. Because that's just what she does. Oh, we are now locked out of him again, too. Well, that's just fantastic. Jesus Christ, the restrictions are getting pretty intense here. Alright, you know what? Let's have a look at Yori again, huh? I think Anakin would probably like that. Two thousand ninety-seven. Juro. Kondo wa Yeah.君は残念だよ。私とあなたに何があったの。でも。真実は見つけた。俺たちは壮大な計画の一部にいるんだ。今の君では説明しても理解できない。計画に修正が必要だ。悪いが行かせてくれ。こっちでも大量殺人をやるつもり。一緒にこっちに来た4人をすでに殺
ミちゃんと同じ日でもしかしてのチーズクイックフィギュアだった読めてよね嘘嘘レンジくんね旅に出てたって言ってたよ旅ねミワちゃんおはよう、リオリちゃんさっきの授業中すっごく船こいでたでしょう先生、また睨んでたよあちゃミワ子は体は大丈夫私私はこの通り元気だよそっかそれならいいよクラベ君夢の中のあの人十郎って呼んでたしクラベ君だよねきっと夢とはいえクラベ君撃っちゃったしなんだか声かけづらいなところでおさみちゃんそうよ戦いに負けて逃げてた大きな怪物に追いかけられて確か一緒に逃げてたのはゴート先輩だわ私こんなに気が多かったっけ学校の男子ばかり夢に突然学校を休んだ2089年確か夢でそう言ってた時間を16年戻ったとも言ってたな予知夢だとすれば2105年に何かが起こる何かあったのあっダメだ理科室鍵がかかってるんだったどうやって理科室に入ろうそのグラッキーフォンドティーチューズですちょっとお腹痛くてもう大丈夫そっかー今日理科室の掃除当番俺じゃんあそこ器具洗ったり面倒だよなあーやだやだせめてもう一人の当番は可愛い女子にしてくれえっ、ー、と沢渡りかよかったなお前とは趣味合わねえ今日の理科室の掃除当番ミワちゃんなんだミワちゃん理科室の掃除当番だよねそうだけどお願いがあるの Let me do it. I mean, you would say no to that, right? 何するつもりかわかんないけど薬品とかは危ないよあ違う違う大丈夫<笑>ちゃんと閉じまりしておくから Is you thinking we're going to mix up a bomb or something or what? 私ゴミ捨て行ってくるからあとよろしくねミワちゃんありがとう Okay, so let's search for the gate again. Toshiko Maiwa Kono Toriga Hikotte. Nanika Nanika Aruhazu Zetani Aru. What? How did that work? <coughs> Sorry. To the future! 
確かこの辺りをこんな感じでさあ彼のいる未来へ連れてって There's no way that that is going to go wrong, right? Androids doing here. また逃げるつもりか俺からまさか426あなたを捕まえる426同じやり取りの繰り返しだもう残された時間はない俺と来てくれ守ってみせるお願いだ良子やめて That's not exactly true. Yeah, I think the way they are talking about all these sectors makes me believe it's really everything on one space colony, though. But I guess we can head back in with her just to, you know, get one character above 80% story completion. So why not with her? Oh, 
美術室だっけうんおうどうしたいより元気ないなえ<笑>そそんなことないよ今日はツツジまで出るんでしょ美和子がレコード屋行きたいってアイドルの新婦だっけ来た来たお待たせーそういえば今夏菜ちゃんと会ったんだけどちょっとバス来た話はあとあと待って乗りまーすすっかり暗くなってる付き合わせちゃってごめんね It's quite pretty though. 残念だったねミワちゃんレコードを売り切れで3件も回ったのにちょっと遅くなっちゃったねお父さん心配性だからな家に電話してみようかなそこに電話ボックスあるよ電話するの Who are you gonna call? That was quick. Do that, da. Yapari, shimpai, steta. Sugo, kai, te, koi, te. Sorry, so da. Desha, no, ga, haya, yo. Did she just dude another girl?
人と一緒だった人たちだよね。What the hell's going on here? That was kind of strange, I want to say. This is a bit strange now. Yeah. Oh, that's not what I was expecting. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Do these guys ever not get beat up? Shosho Namaterugana. Eno Ikutska Murachimata. I guess at this point they are more there for comedic comedic relief than for an actual threat now, aren't they? Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. Where did she come from? おまわりさん呼んできた。こりゃ。どういうことだわ、島。おまわりさん呼んできてくれて。うさみちゃんありがとう。急いで改札に逃げ込めばよかったのに。本当どうしなんだから。ごめんね。ね。こいつらはどう
what else am I supposed to do? What's going on now? Oh, hey, there he is. Cool motorcycle, I guess. I love you.
何か勘違いしてるようだな涼子さんは恋人じゃない親が留守がちで一人だった俺を姉のように面倒を見てくれた俺にとって彼女は家族だ感謝してるし幸せでいてほしいそれだけだそうなの中学ではすさんでたからな告白されたのなんて小学校以来だ先輩彼女じゃないんだ君と俺はいろいろ因縁がある俺が君を殺しに未来から来た殺人犯だったらどうするそそれでも好きです名前も知らない男なのにそれでも<笑>君が俺を思いもよらないな俺は関ヶ原エイ関ヶ原エイまだ断られてはないんですよねもう家に帰れ今後は勝手に俺を探すなよこちらから連絡する。Okay, so he actually came here to assassinate Morimura. Which, as we know, is, well, the mature self of Yuri. So I guess he did accomplish his mission because when we started playing as him, you know, um, she was lying dead in front of him. He just couldn't remove her because his memories got wiped. Hey, I guess we're. Kind of getting far into the story here because all these characters are getting locked behind uh, pretty high story progressions of other characters. Alright. I think it's time for some more Tomi because she's pretty far behind behind everybody else, so let's give that a try. So we had my apartment, that kaiju, that. Sakura, you need Sakura High School. Okay. Let's see how we can get Sakura High School. And we'll probably go ahead and visit that in the future. Okay. <laughs> ちょっと思ったんだけど私たちがこうなる前学校にいたよね学校に戻るべきなんじゃないかな、oh, なんでそこがタイムスリップした場所だから元の場所に戻る何かヒントがあったりしないかな That was easy and quick. Horeo. Soko no convini de mitsketa. My chocolate. Miracomo. Amaino nigate da gara. Zembu yario. Arigato. Onta mo nani ko tobe da homa. Ora ganjo ni dictenda. Kinisuna. ここにいてもしょうがねえぞ行くなら暗くなる前に出ないとどうする分かってる少し休ませてこれからどうするよ何か燃やしてのろしをあげるかひょっとしたらどこかにいるかはい、いつも食べる。糖分を補充で復活した。シャガラシ、カミング。寒い。
Alright, let's talk to her about... I think we talked to her about the dead kaiju, but not about the apartment. やっぱり誰もいなかったわ。きっとみんなと避難してるよ。そっか。他には何か怪獣見てきたけど、あれは。yeah, we had that before. Where have we? Because they didn't. There's no time travel here, it's all a lie. Don't make me think otherwise. の言う通りかも。森村はいつも学校にいたし。もしかしたら。タイムマシンは学校にあるのかも。森村って。森村先生のこと。それ。胸のでかい保険の先生だろ。彼女も未来人よ。<笑><笑> の惑星を開拓する計画。開拓用の大型重機が怪獣の正体。なぜ過去の地球に現れたのだろう。学校へ戻ろう。2年どうすんだ。置いてくのか。そうだった。私が先輩についてるから。二人で行ってみて。すまねえが頼むぜ。何かわかったらすぐ戻ってくるからね。そんなに急ぐと焦げるぞ。道路がボコボコだ。のんきね。道が塞がってて時間食ったから。ちょっとでも急ぎたいの
前が乗っている13番騎兵は誰より僕がうまく使えるからさ急がせて悪いが時間はないぞママを見つけてからよ森村先生作戦変更よ泉十郎が出撃した彼のナノマシンはそれほど持たない実験を始めないと間に合わなくなる避難は後回し急いでその子を連れてきて What test though? Alright, I think we will do one more and then we will get into some battles. Why don't we? I guess we could check in with A. Now we play with the Ori, so it's only logical to continue with A, I guess. Okay, we need Natsuno or any of the others. Still don't know what that is about. Nani kana password or kan? Futsu no keikan ka? What was the other one needed? The phaser. Omoi kai shite mireba. Kono ju. Mirai no chika shitsu de. Doroid ga tsukatta mono to onachi da. Kimi. So much for that, I suppose. <laughs> I mean, I was just wondering how he was holding that out in the open. But nobody noticing or anything happening. Morimura Morimura So maybe let's think about them once more. No, I need damage or water. Nano machine, no virus program, no yona monota. Saishu taking a kioko ushinaka, Haijinka. Ore no kioko sois no gain in Machiga in Naitaro. Morimura Chihiro no Hatari Tita Hokensi ni atta monote. Ore no motte ita kusrito onajira berniwa. Keiko and C zero nine zero one to R. Sakura Kokoro no Seto, Amiguchi Shu, Izumi Juro, so shite Shino no Meriyoko, three nine no Karte, three nine ni NM to yu na no kusuri ga tsukawarete iru. 
俺は別の世界から来た人間で森村千尋が話していた次の作戦イージス作戦が実行されるとこの世界から脱出ができなくなるあいや、that makes sense 森村千尋 Because you know when they start Operation Aegis by turning on the mainframe of that UFO or whatever They're basically blocking the gate access, which lets you jump between the different colonies. And that is why they would be left behind in this destroyed uh, world. Makes sense to me. Morimura has the memo. I don't know the meaning of this number. I don't know the meaning of this number. This is what I have the meaning of. The emblem of the emblem. Uh, so that is how he summons his motorcycle. おしてみたがどこかで音がしたとか特にそういうのもないな近くにはないだけか未来の地下施設であのドロイドが使っていた銃だ古い型の操縦心機。There it is. なんだ誰も乗っていないバイクがもしかして鍵のボタンで来たのか音声認証登録者ロックの解除には鍵が必要です音声ナビいや違うな自動運転のロボットバイクだ登録者は関ヶ原エイ森村千尋以上2名です。俺と森村。このバイクに乗っていたのなら、俺がどこにいたのかがわかるはずだ。移動の記録が残っているな。表示できるか？ 走行ログ表示。地図上をずいぶんうろうろしてるが、何度も訪れている場所は2箇所。桜高校以外では1箇所だけだ。目的地にセットしますか？あ。And which location would that be? その場所に案内してくれ。何か残していないか。すみません。もう少し正確に表現してください。メッセージを記録していないか。関ヶ原エイの記録は二件あります。本当か？再生しますか？あ、やってくれ。見つけたか？俺のつまりお前の勘が当たった。
So now we have confirmation. So much for that, I suppose. That's a big question, isn't it? I think that the the かと思えば おかしいな。君は。うん。やはり<笑> そんなわけがない。集中して。お、おい、大きな。僕の顔をよく見て思い出すはずだ。1944。待ってくれ。これはまさか。<笑> しかし、ディディ4264の作用を遅らせる効果がある。第3世代。19番機兵じゃないか。こんなところに転移していたとは。この建物は騎兵の格納庫なのか。Kinda, I guess.君の質こさには負けたよ。やはり大きいのだ。こんな格好までしたのに見つかるとはね。あの事件以来隠れているのか。セクター5に。どうして僕を探していたんだ。関ヶ原君。DD-426の作用を止めたい。お前は詳しいんだろ、DD-426のことに。あの戦場で撒かれた行動だ。君は撒いた犯人を知っているかいや、どうだかな。僕が身を隠す理由だよ。誰も信用できない。もちろん君も
優先処理の追加コードかそれでは直せないそりゃそうだ無意味な処理で時間稼ぎしてるだけだお前は治ってる作用を止められるんだろうそれは無理だ1年前くらいかな426の作ったこのコードを見つけた DD426 をね D コードを分離するため自分に試したんだそれであの戦場では効果がなかった僕はすでに記憶を失ってる Wait, he tested the memory loss code on himself before the battle. Oh, and that's why it didn't affect him anymore during the battle because he already had lost all his memories? Oh, is that why they are giving them the pills? Because if their memories would resurface, they couldn't actually fight because they would get overloaded by the Sentinel link. Wait, what now? He himself doesn't carry his memories, but his nano machines, which are still inside of him. もとが模擬人格でも今は脳に定着してる。今の僕は大きの司だ。大きの司の記憶を持つ。大きの司の人格。君から見れば何も変わらない。だが別物だ。以前の大きのとは違う。人間は常に変化するものだ。記憶を失
一つ聞いておきたいな。嫌がっていたようなのに結局この方法に頼る。心変わりの理由は何だい？何も変わっちゃいないさ。こんなのは最悪だ。だが忘れたくないことがある。お前のその憎たらしい顔とかな。その記
Wow, that takes a lot of EP to cast, though. Wait, what did I just do? Not what I wanted to do. Just wanted to switch these two around so they are in order of EP used. <sighs> okay, who else? I think I want to take one generation two at least. Actually, what are we up against? Drill fly. Well, the drill fly were the flyers. Pressure current increases when deployed in consecutive battles. Oh. Okay. Let's maybe quickly check their skills. Increases defense of guardians and sentry guns. Gata is in the strike team. Rate recovery speed increases. Okay, but she's not in the battle, so that's no matter. I think I would just take Ryoko with me. Because if there are many flying enemies, I don't think our melee units would cut it. Then again, I should definitely make sure that I have some... Um, Armor piercing abilities with me this time. Oh, baby. Uh, what do I switch that with? Those are also good. out of upgrade points. Means I can't get that for her. Ah, yeah, I should have taken that. Oh well, it is what it is. Probably have gotten that as well. God damn it. Need more points. I can't unlock anything more for him. Just anything else I can upgrade or unlock or whatnot. Two rockets plus two. I think I'm gonna upgrade her missiles a little bit more. Okay. Maximum four strike team members. Army Gucci is on. Do this. How bad can it be, right?
それにユキちゃんのは足も強いだろかかとのスパイクは強力なパイルバンカーで高圧電流を放って相手の内部も破壊するだが出力が高いため連続使用すればすぐに攻撃できなくなるぞ Okay, it's nah, not quite in the corner, but close enough. Why does he have so few EP there? Okay, attacks are coming from here. He's a pretty good position there. Could defend a bit, should charge. Yeah, let's do that while we don't have good targets. Alright, there they are. So let's see how these missiles will do against them. Bit of luck, they were completely eradicated. Oh, no luck then. <laughs> Maybe he will do the trick there. Yeah, he has to move out of there. Need him closer to the front lines. So let's deploy some of these to help. That's a bit of a waste, though. Great. Didn't hit anything. Oh, they have way more HP than I thought they would still have. What happened over there? Holy crap. Okay, let's move him a little bit closer. Also, we can now use this a second time, so let's put down even more defenses. Big one with them. Is that a terror carrier? It is. Uh, can't remember if I brought any TMP. That could actually be a bit of a problem. I really don't think I brought any EPs. This could be interesting. Oh, that thing is still taking good damage, though. So that makes me happy. Still doesn't have enough EP to use that. Charge. All of you keep charging stuff. Sure. More defenses. Can 
me to shoot down all these missiles, please. any of those near me. Alright, destroyed one of the big ones. Oh, that actually does some good damage. I'm surprised. Sure, more sentry guns. <laughs> like, damn, we have so many stuff on the battlefield now. Okay, here we go. Super large missile. However, I don't think we'll actually need it because that seems to be the last enemy on the field. <laughs> Which actually makes me a bit sad. Maybe we just destroy them. That was surprisingly easy. I mean, after that last battle. I really thought that this would be way harder. But it wasn't. This was actually pushover compared to that. Look at that damage we took. <laughs> we won't lose again. Okay. Big brother. I mean, if that isn't going to be an ass rank, I will be sorely disappointed. I mean. Got the S rank reward. I we took, you know, point three percent damage. <laughs> Jeez, dude. All right, got all the bonus objectives as well. Three mystery points. Oh, would you look at that? Not yet. No. Got another boss battle coming up. Oh boy. Kinda itching to do it though. But let's first. Um, no, I'll have a look here. Loading onto Sigaha as he takes the home on his motorcycle, Fuyuzaka confesses her love for him. Isn't that nice? Yoko Shinamone was like a big sister to Sigahara, who spent a lot of time alone when his parents weren't around. To Sigahara, Shinamone is family, and he only wants her to be happy. Kaza Okino, since he had used DD426 on himself and attempted to detach the decode, he wasn't affected by the Sentinel Infection incident in 2064. Although he lost his memories from detaching the decode, no one could tell the difference between the original Okino and the current one. This was because he preserved his memories in his nanomachines and ensured the similar personality that makes up his identity would be affixed to his brain. Alright, so what is the difference between DD246 and the decode again? Like, I think the decode summons the Dimos, and the DD426 erases your memories. Is that it? Do we have anything on record for that?
Actually, let's like, take a look at 246. 246 is the prisoner number of an escaped criminal from the future. His real name is Juru Izumi. He's already dead and currently exists as a replication that is based off of the memory information written onto Sector Zero. He had previously been researching ways to download memories from the inner locator, Lociter, and how to get into the production line of the Dimos code. He escaped, oh, he escaped confinement through transferring his own data into an android that looked like Tomi Kisaragi. The Kisaragi android that 246 was using as his body got destroyed during the battle against the Tamao Kurabe android in 1985. He then took over the Tamao android's body and managed to escape. What else do we have here? The generation Sentinels. These Sentinels specialize in long-range attacks. The, the, three th se blah, blah, blah. the three Sentinels of this generation are number 16, 17, and 19. The pilot of each respective Sentinel during the final battle was Tomiki Saragi, number 16, Natsuno Minami, number 17, and Keita Keitaro Miura, number 19. Downtown, air near the scramble crossing in front of Tsutsuji Ward, Shiro Yashiocho, Tsutsuji Station. It's an extremely crowded spot where nearly 3,000 people cross the street during a single green light in peak hours. What? Three. Sa Man, I can't speak today. 3,000 people during one green light. Mm, I can. Maybe have another look at that. The dream that Juro Kurabe told Iori Fuizaka about in the science room. It's a dream about two rebels who travel back in time to bomb an interstellar development facility they believe to be the cause of an apocalypse. Kurabe claims that the woman who appears in the leather jumpsuit looked just like Fuizaka. Yeah, the problem is it was way bigger than that though. It wasn't only that one facility. Enya Goto and Morimura snatched Tomiki Saragi away while she was searching for her mother in a commercial building of Kamazumi Ward. Yep, that definitely happened. What's about UFO mysteries? Ah, god damn it, shouldn't have done that. It's about a TV series that shows shocking footage and the latest info about UFOs. The entire series is presented documentary style. Although UFOs and aliens never actually end up appearing, the search for them is fascinating enough to carry the show. The key to Seigao's motorcycle, the emblem portion is a button. Pressing it causes the motorcycle to drive itself to the key's coordinates. That's really handy. Try to ride the cycle to school even though it's against the rules. Another Shikishima. Okay, I guess that's it so far. Let's jump back into the story. So let's see, do we have anybody who is still under 50%? Yeah, we got Keitaro. Yuki. And the rest we cannot access. So why don't we go ahead with Keitaro? You know, get everybody up to 50% and then we will decide from there. Yeah, he's taking another look at the Sentinel. I mean, because it's simulated. <laughs> that's Uno Minami. I guess let's proceed with that then. ジンジャニー
騎兵を再起動できなかったどこか壊れてしまったのだろうか交渉なら騎兵を詳しく調べたいが建物周辺の警備が厳しくなって今は近づけない。Oh, yeah, you know what I just realized? When they were talking about this interstellar exploration stuff, you know, Keitaro and Natsune in 2188, he was talking about that he would have liked to be reborn, if possible, in, you know, the 1940s in Japan, because he thought that that time period was pretty interesting. And that is where he ended up. So what I believe at the moment is that they went through with their, you know, interstellar exploration, uh, colonization stuff, and you could actually choose on which colony to go, you know, because they were modeled after different points in time, as to maybe accommodate people better, something like that, maybe, who knows. Uh, so I guess we have to go with 1945 now, huh? Yeah. Sounds like that is what we are supposed to do here. Maybe underground. Oh, look who it is. Shihiro. Shihiro, じゃないか。妹に何か用かな。誰だ。私はその子の兄だが。妹がどうかしたかい。Because it is her. Chihiro is the keyword we need to proceed. How do we do that then? Natsuno san ni hanashi o kiko. Kanojo wa nani ka o shitte iru. Okay, no. Guess that triggered it. Okay, 
床板脇しみ柱は傷だらけ40年の歳月か I'm starting to doubt that. ここで高利さんを待って、玉尾さんたちに見送られた。まるであれは夢だったかのような不思議な気分だ。いや、今は感傷に浸っている時ではないな。Yeah, nothing else to do here. Well, apparently not. Okay. Let's return then. Ara, Miura Kun. Megumi san. Ita da ita obento. Kaede gawa no tsumi de tabemashita. Niku dango iri no obento nante. Gosee de odorokimashita. ずうのミートボールよ。大げさね。こんなところで何してるの？もしかして誰か待ってるの？夏野さんを訪ねてきたのですが、めぐみさんはご存知ありませんか？南さんなら部活だと思う。陸上部の部室はあっち。見てこようか。いえ、大丈夫です。そうだ。今晩の夕飯だけど、この間好評だったハンバーグにするつもり。あの大きな肉団子ですか？ジュロモコブツだし。ハンバーガー。だからあんまり遅くならないで。ハンバ
じゃあそこで話すよ行きましょう Well, let's see what's going to happen there 鍵かかってないんだ Why does nobody check? ここならいいかな三浦君秘密守れるははいじゃあ秘密<笑>教えてあげる驚かないでね<笑>彼は BJ 未来から来た宇宙人なのはい。ではロボットを探してる私はそのお手伝いをなぜ騎兵のことをそれに宇宙人が作ったものだと日本で極秘裏に作られた秘密兵器だぞあなたも体験したように時間の移動もできるすっごいロボットなの<笑>どう<笑>驚いたでしょあなたが BJ と呼ぶこれですが四季島の技術者から聞いた話では探査装置の一種ですその人たちが宇宙人のテクノロジーを軍事利用しようとしてるんだわしかしいやいいだろう装置なら喋る必要ないじゃないちょっと三浦君これは彼らの宇宙服なの失礼になっちゃうでしょきっと服の中は頭脳だけなんだよ<笑> Well, you know, she isn't completely wrong I mean, you can think of an AI It's just a brain inside of that, can't you? 宇宙人まさか何のために騎兵を探している狙いは何だ真実を知ること真実ミニシャどこから来たか知りたいか昭和20年だろう違うじりと記録したその証拠私の記録何を見せて Here we go. Oh, shit. あれもしかしてゆうきちゃんシャトルはどうでしたおかげで席が取れたわおそらくこれが最後のシャトルね明日にはここも飲まれるもうそこまで前線が被害拡大は加速してる夏野は無事に脱出できたセクター4には5時間前にそこにいるのね三浦君と夏野の交際私はまだ認めてないけどなえお母さん出てきた<笑>冗談よもう口も聞いてくれないのかと思ったそんなことは南家のことであなたを苦しめたのは謝るわ私は別れたあの人によく思われてないから
ちゃん。14時間後にセクター Well, I think this kind of hammers my point at home that we indeed are way further into the future. Because what BJ is probably going to tell us now is that it took place, you know, in 2188 or something. So, Kato is from that period of time, not 1945. <laughs> Now here it comes. <laughs>おかしいじゃない。なんでミライでユキちゃんが私のお母さんに。<laughs> Where do we come from? Where do we come from indeed? Okay guys, um, I'm going to take a very quick break here because I have run out of water and I do need to use the bathroom so I'm, you know, gonna go for a little quick run here. So don't go anywhere, you know, give your brains a rest for a minute or two here, go and stretch your legs or do whatever. And we'll be back in just a moment to you with more of this incredible game. All right, catch you in a few. Actually, let me just go ahead, make a quick save. And leave you guys off at the title screen. Because the music here is fantastic. All right, guys, see you in a moment.
Alright, and we are back. So I guess let's continue on with Yuki. Uh, just a quick word here. I am a little bit hungry, so I made me a sandwich. So while I'm playing here, I will just you know, quickly switch off the camera. So you guys don't have to see me eating here. Anyway, let's hop in with her, I guess. Gotta go to the front gate and do stuff. Push. トイレの事件はまだ謎だらけだが、なっちゃんが関わっているのは確かだ。他に手がかりになるものがないか探そう。リンゴジュースだ。ガキの頃よくなっちゃんと一緒に飲んだもんだぜ。探しましたよ。またここにいたんですね。暇でいいな、お前。高宮さんがホームズで。バトソンは私、相葉エリカ。エリカと呼んでください。今日も事件解決に向けて頑張りますよ。どういう風に捜査を始めます? <笑> あ、あの方たち高宮さんのお知り合いですかああ。こいつを出しながら俺とも仲良くしねえとな。おい。手出したら分かってんだろうな。ああ、分からねえな。てめえ。分からせてやるよ。お前ら何をしている Oh, so much for that, I suppose. <clears throat> but yeah, I mean, you know, Wajima is just getting his shit kicked and every time he shows up, like, dude, catch a hint. Nah. もう帰っていいだろ? ダメだ。参ったな。定額なんて食らっちまったら。ねがねがなんて言うか。ソーリー。うろうろせず。おとなしくしていなさい。What <coughs> あとは任せてくれ。The ogre. <laughs> oh, 
鬼兵のおっさん相変わらずで安心したよ高宮輪島たちは逃げちまってわからんが捕まった仲間二人は軽傷だなあいつらに連れてかれてから心配してたんだぞ高宮転校していたとは何があった特務機構のやつらと関係があるのか知ってるなら話しちゃくれねえかおっさん悪いが言えねえんだうん半年前くらいに輸送中の重機の事故とされた事件があったその時事故に巻き込まれた東雲涼子と名乗る少女を保護したが東雲お前の時と同様強引に特記のやつらが連れ去ってしまった彼女はこう言ったんだ怪獣と戦うために未来から兵器と共に来たとねまさかその話信じたのか最近また重機の事故があってな天幕で隠される前にたまたま現場を見たこれにゃああれが建設機械とは到底思えなかった<笑>この町で何かが起きてる知りたいんだ話しちゃくれねえか<笑>話しちゃくれねえか島冷蔵庫やテレビの CM のあれかなあの会社が秘密メガネの話じゃ情報特務機構とかって政府のスパイ組織で札とは違うらしいが私からすりゃどっちもどっちだ。I actually thought that when you do this, she actually changes around, like you know, with a little animation there. Oh, you probably have to take care of the notebook. Oh, you probably have to take care of the notebook. Oh, you probably h オニヘのおっさんは大人でも信用できる方だ話して協力してもらうのもありかし先週から行方不明になってる南夏の警察では探してないのか南夏のこっちに届けでは出てない桜高校の一年だ奴らが探してる。何か分かったら教えてほしい。俺も探してみよう。特務機構のことは。そっちでどれだけ分かってるんだ。かなり上の方と繋がってるようで。下っ端じゃ手出しできん。俺の分かる範囲だと。奴らは敷島重工をいろいろと調べてる。だ。どこまで本当か知らねえがメガネの話じゃ敷島が核爆弾積んだ兵器を作っててその兵器に何人かの子供が関与してるそいつらを監視しろと転校させられた子供篠宮涼子も桜高校にいる見てくれ銃器搬入で行動を制限するための書類だ彼女が乗ってきたと言ったものは敷島重工の新しい造船ドックに運ばれてるここへ行けば重機が何なのかなっちゃんに何があったのかわかるかもしれないお
鬼兵のおっさんの話を聞いて勢いで電車に駆け込んじまった四季島重工の造船ドックねそこに一体何があんのか<笑>むしゃぶるいがするぜ She's like a real detective here. Oh, we needed all of that, huh? Alright, what do we gotta do here? I think about something. Robot got hakobicomare to Shikishima Juko no dokua. Mina to Chikak no umeta techide. So Kobakari no Sabishiba Shoniaru. Kono mama shute made it. She sets no Chikak de Mato. Oh, hey, it's an NG. Hmm? Takomiya. <笑>今は自陣地に住んでんだ。お前はどこ行くんだ。え。まあ、その海を見に。かな。大丈夫か、お前。That <笑> あいつと。あ。あいつはアイバじゃねえだろ。アイバをずっと休みのままだし。あ。まもなく開けるに。あ、シーズだろば。お。俺は。エンドロイド。階段近くに移るわ。じゃな。It has been それならあいつは誰なんだ。ザック。何を信じりゃいいんだ。この目で一つ一つ確かめるしかねえか。まずは敷島の兵器だ。ああ、ヘストリーソージとピックアップ。随分経験で。That was great. Well, I can see the essential is just fine. Digumi no Ogata ga yu ni wa Aiba Erika wa betsu jin da. Nara atashi ni tsuki matou no wa dare nan da. Nan no mokuteki de atashi ni. が運び込まれたっていう。来るべき戦いで我々のやつる武器で。そして君もこれに乗ることができる一人だ。高宮ゆきくん。てめえはリストに名前のあった。ゴートレンヤ。我々のこれは私の騎兵よ。騎兵。
待ち伏せていたのかそういうことだ。これは、四季島が作った兵器なんだろう。作ったのは四季島じゃない。我々だよ。お前ら、何者なんだ我々にとって、ここは過去の世界だ。タイムトラベル、本気で言ってんのか騎兵は未来世界で作られた兵器だまさかてめえあたしを売ったのか何の話かしら私が14番をうまく動かせるのあなたなんかに渡さないわこれが騎兵なっちゃんが探してた宇宙人と戦うためのロボット<笑>宇宙人あほなレイリアンザーレ宇宙人と戦うつもりだったの<笑>お前らはこれで何する気なんだ怪獣から世界を救うのよ<笑>下がってなんだそれ本物か確かめてみるどけよお前ら二人で私の相手になるかそうはいかない君も騎兵に関わってる私は関係ねえさっきの光が証拠だ私に何をしたのか知らねえが付き合ってらんねえよどうでした何度もコードが書き足されてる彼と何度も接触をおそらくこの子の近くにお前は保健室の高宮由紀もう少し調べたいわバンパイロットマークちょっと待って、ちょっと待って、ちょっと待って、ちょっと待って、ちょっと待って、ちょっと待って、ちょっと Step into Ryoko. Guess we can do something on the stairs now. See if anything changed here, but I guess not. まだ寝ていた方がいい心配無用質問に性分かってるそちょっとくす What can we show her? 井田先生はどこにいるの2064年の戦闘から行方不明よ覚えてない覚えてる。That's the same as ever. Alright. So you. We gotta talk to Chomi again.
and then run off from Renya. This just takes me to the vending machines, right? Yeah, no, okay. Then it was left. And we get intercepted on the staircases. Yeah. Okay, so now what? Just ignore him. No such luck. Can we talk to him again? Anything else we can do here other than talk to Shu? You can do now. So let me not say now. I think this was different. Yeah, go to the cafeteria now. All right. Cafeteria. Okay, do not take the pill. Tokumukiko, no senior 
また忘れちまったのか潜入要員もうダメ頭が割れそうメガネに弱み握られてスパイをやらされてたろメガネ特務機構の井田哲也だ<笑>井田先生が何で It's always losing you. Signs from shift. あなたが最初に設置した理科室のゲート網口がいないあそこに置き去りだ本心を聞かせて井田先生私は利用されているだけ利用されるのは構わないあなたが望むなら先生の気持ちが他の子にあるのは許せない先生はあの子とやり直すために私たちを見捨てる東雲君落ち着きたまえ勘違いだ研究室の映像を見てずっと苦しんでた<笑>君は混乱している薬を飲んで冷静になるんだ決めたの今日で決別するスタンモード解除え<笑>ま待てしののめくさよなら先生Okay. That was unexpected. Oh, yeah, that recording about how he built、uh, Tomi, I guess. Okay, here we go. What piece of the puzzle are we going to get this time? When two four six was freed, right? It wasn't creepy at all. Oh, 
えばねこいつらが入れないよう連絡通路の扉はロックしたのに監視カメラに何か残ってないかなこれ以上調べ前回来た時からの監視映像あった森村とゴーとレンヤが何度か来てる通路を開けたのは彼らかそうか監視映像を遡れば記録を消したのが誰かわかるかも426 I suppose Thousand one hundred. Oh, he noticed. Okay. This is really starting to be like Neon Genesis Evangelion. Need a reset, huh? Where have we heard that before? But yeah, what, what he just said that you know that her original consciousness is still in the UFO just starts to hammer my point home. Um, that all of these colonies are populated by clones or artificial humans or whatever who get you know implanted memories from the future uh, no the past 
reincarnations or something like that. Destruction second area, Shibugaki City Wave 10. Well, it's gonna be a long while until that happens. I mean, we are just, you know, at the first area wave 10. <laughs> we have to clear a whole battle area until we can play with her again. Holy crap. Oh, that's gonna take a while. All right, how do we take, we take a jab at Kuro, uh, Juro again? Why do I keep calling him Kuro? Probably because of Sekiro. The little Lord was named Kuro. Okay, so you have to find out where Amiguchi is. We go to the break area. And then do something, I don't know what. But then I really gotta say that I kind of like how the game is structured that, you know, you can't just immediately finish one character's story path because that would probably reveal too much of what's going on. Instead, you know, you have to play around with the other characters. Wait. Where are you going? Don't leave me. I need to know where Amiguchi is. So when are we finally fi going to find out what his deal is? Sure, I don't think we've had that. At least as far as I'm aware. <sighs> oh, that's actually a whole new thing here. Daily life. Wait, did that automatically get filled in now? Uh, I guess. ついてねえな。ビデオ屋が休みなんて。あの様子だと当分開かないだろうね。ガラス爆発事故に巻き込まれたんだな。Gas explosion. Sure. ミラ君じゃないか。こんなところで何してるの？学校から君をつけてきた。That Wasted
ガス爆発じゃない君があの向こう側に騎兵を転送した転送映画の話かそういうのあったよなああそういえば芝君に借りたビデオにあったね十郎君君は誰と話してるんだ Oh, wait, right. Remember when we were playing as Yuro, we went to Amiguchi's place? And Shiba was there. But when we played that same scene as Amiguchi, Shiba wasn't there. <laughs> so Shiba's just a fragment of Yuro's imagination now. どこにいる。<笑> この間貸したやつ、どうだった見たよ、借りた映画。でも今日はテープ持ってきてない。返すのはいつでもいいよ。それより映画の感想は追い詰めた犯人が体に乗り移って結局主人公が犯人になるなんて好き嫌いの分か
しいぞ小学校で芝君と一緒だったのも中学のことも思い出せない This fucking game, man. Shibakun. Boku to isho da ta te yu kedo. Kimi to no omoi de o. Kutai teki ni. Nani mo omoi dase nai da. Naze da to omo. Sasuga ni mujun ga oku te kizuku yo na. Nan no hanashi. ここのところ無理な記憶操作をやりすぎた<笑>難しいことを考えるなソラちゃんとビデオを持ってけ次の記憶のやつだ帰ってじっくり見るんだ old self strange to overtake him 待ってくれ落ち着いて思い出したんだ彼は芝君は<笑>僕にしか見えてないのかお前にしか見せてないからなうまくやらないとこういうボロが出るんだよな君は何なの合成人格489つまり、シバキュータだ。我ながら適当だよな。お前の性格に合わせて作ってみた。こういう人格の方が話しやすいだろ。シバキュータ。逃げたってもう遅い。お前の頭の中には、映された記憶がみっちりだ。安心しろ。俺に任せとけば問題ない記憶そうさ俺の記憶がな落ち着くんだ誰もいないはっきり見えてる何も知らずにいた方が楽なのにバカだな芝君の記憶を僕に移すって芝じゃない俺が泉十郎さ There we go. どうせこのことも忘れちまうんだ。騒げば変人だと思われるぞ。さあ、ともよ。新しいビデオだ。おかしな現実はいっそ忘れろ。これを見ろよ。面白いぜ。お前の頭をきれいにする。や,やめ。十六。Uh, <laughs> game Y. We just can't leave it hanging at this point now, can we? That's probably why he has to take his pills so that uh, he suppresses exactly what's otherwise bound to happen. He's going to be taking back his body. Yo, Jiro, Kairoze. Moskaste Mata on a jitoko de Matiawase. まあそんなとこまたねなんだよおっかない顔してさてとまたおかしな夢でも見たかやめろよ君は僕にしか見えてないんだろう<笑>どうやらうまく消えてないようだなやれやれ記憶操作は限界か君は何なんだ489
合成人格だと言ったろそれじゃわからないよ<笑>まあビデオでも見て落ち着けよ誰が見るもんかなぜ僕に泉十郎の記憶を元に戻そうとしているのか何も考えるな今のお前が異常な状態なんだ。Oh, he does have a point. I got it as a social medium. I got it as a social medium. I g o 事件で記憶をなくして別の人格に変えられたのが今の僕クラベチュロエクストリーレマンスミカンドオフセノギエズウェルウィティホールベイエンドアイディシチュエーションでシバクンは人間じゃないそして彼が僕の記憶を操作してイズミチュロに変えようとしている逃げられないぜや,やめだわすあっ、ファイクイック。あげす、ウィトクトロンチュドゥー。帰ろうぜもしかしてまたまあまたうん Can we do anything else here? さてとそして彼が僕イズミチュ未来から事件別今の。階段での話を彼女に尋ねても寂しそうな目をしてごまかすだけだ<笑>過去に遡って滅亡の原因と思われる研究施設を爆破し研究員を撃ち殺したんだ冬坂さんに似た人が仲間だった南さんが突然三浦君を家に連れてきたんだ薬師寺だけでも問題なのに僕の夢の一人暮らしはめちゃくちゃだ僕が学生たちを殺して回ってた殺した人の中に冬坂さんや薬師寺がこれが記憶なら本当にあんなことを Sure、did, dude. 僕と冬坂さんだけが16年前のすみれ橋に逃れたんだこれも芝君の別の泉十郎の記憶か何だよおっかない顔してまたおかしな夢でも見たかやめろよ君は僕にしか見えてないんだろう,うまく消えてないようだやる記憶操作なぜ僕にいずれも元に戻そう何も考え今のお前何も考え今のお前何も考え今のお前何 So we have to do something else after that. Anything else we can do? 
2016年これもし別。The bag. Leave. Oh, okay. Lots of options there now. Wait, but does that also mean when, because, you know, Iori and Shu also had all these m dreams of their memories, that other personalities are trying to take over them as well. Like, is Morimura trying to take over Iori, and is Ida trying to take over Shu?
彼がそんなことをするはずがない。そうだ。そうだ。しばくんは。記憶をビデオで渡すんだ。ビデオ。未来の出来事だと。冬坂さんも言っていた。Yeah, from the past, though. t a s k t e r どうだった重郎転移先はまさに侵略の最中だった命からがら戻ってきたんだあの様子だと壊滅だろう年代は1985年だ映画館のチラシ記録では平成に閉鎖されてなくなったツツジの映画館さ4は1985年セクター3が2025年だからまた40年遡ってるこのタイムマシンで行ける時代はどこも侵略者に襲われてるなぜ過去にも現れるんだろうわからないよ<笑> Come on guys it's all the same point in time I'm going to die on that ship. <laughs> I'm saying it's all at the same time. There's no time traveling. You're just switching the sector. Skasakun, what do you mean? Karela got a conny shinyak stamara. Boktach no shiru reximo machimo mujun steru. Tashkani, Boktachga. Shinyak saritano a kyone. Nisen shak yonenda. Dakedo kakoni. Kaiju ga kita kirok nante nai. タイムパラドックスか。きっと奴らが来たことで。平行世界に分かれたんだ。怪獣には時間を戻る技術があるんだ。未来に影響がないとは考えにくい。いや。これを時間移動の装置だと考えるのは。想計なのかもしれないよ。<笑>揺れてる。They be digging. Tayenda. Dosa. Count to Danka. Zero in Hatter. Mother, come to sing.
どうしたんだどのセクターも設定できないわからない反応がないんだどこか行けそうな時代を探す装置にいてくれ急いで不明だが今行けるのはここだけだスカス君早く装置にダメだタイマーがセットできない操作する君たちだけでも行ってくれスカス君ブルワーズデクターゼロアゲン2089町のディスプレイに書いてあったここは2089年僕らは16年前に戻ったんだそうか通りでほら見て川向こうの再開発エリアに新世紀タワーがないわけだわ2100年にできたビルだから立つのはまだ10年以上先なのねこのまま待っててもダメだ行こう司君はもう来ないほらその向こうの敷島ステートビルも行こうずっとここにいる気この時代僕と君はまだ赤ん坊で君のお母さんだって君がわからない僕たちの国民 ID も使えない決済どころか公共機関はどれも無理見知った街に見えてもこの16年前の世界は僕らにとって異世界だ戻れない以上どうにかしないとこれからどうするの15年後に起こる災難をみんなに知らせなきゃ信じると思うわからない信じなきゃ僕たちで何とかするしかないどうなるか知っているのは僕たちだけだ円盤に戻る方法を探そう今もこの地面の下にあるはずだあそこに戻ればそうか沖野君を救いに時間を戻れるかもしれないかもしれないだからまず今日生きるのが先決だ食料の確保と眠る場所を探そうそうね行こう<笑>それから二人は何年か裏社会で生きていくんだ夢に出てきた彼の名は沖野の司と言っていたどこかで彼を見たことがあるような近づかないで<笑>その記憶は以前のあなたのものじゃない森村と共に16年を巻き戻したあいつだわ誰なの何度も時間を遡って繰り返してる人物時間を信じられないなそいつの記憶よでも名前は泉十郎だ未来の僕ってこと違う別の泉十郎、Different. 消滅した世界の別の存在近づかないで危険な存在だと教わったわ
じゃあ僕が夢で見るのは消えた世界の記憶で芝君が別の世界の泉十郎その人物は意識だけをドロイドに移して逃げた意識だけ<笑>おやおや先輩は調子が良くなさそう芝君ったくおしゃべりだなやめろおいおい篠宮涼子は変なんだ言ってることを真に受けるとお前もおかしくなるぞ。Who are you? That is a good question. And that is. <laughs> of course, he would be locked now as well. Yeah, we are starting to lose characters here behind the locks. <laughs> ah, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Um, day of study completed. That sounds wonderful, dude. Then, uh, you now have the time to try and, you know, wrap your brain around all of this here, I suppose. <laughs> Turn through on the completion. Yeah, you know. Uh, we are starting to get into the flow of things, although, if you look at that, we have played way more of the story than we have of the battles. Uh, so, you know, I mean, basically yesterday we did nothing but story. I mean, we only did one battle or so, so, why don't we go ahead and actually, you know, do another one. Because it's been a while again, and we have another boss at our hands. And it's probably going to be the last wave of Area 1, which is exciting. Oh, no, but we want to understand this. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Definitely wouldn't be a bad idea, I suppose. But, um... Yeah, why don't we go ahead and do a boss battle here? Gosh. Ashitaba City Battle 10, Wave 10, Boss Battle, Incoming. Giant mobile factory. RPF Kaiju will appear. Mobile factory. Now that sounds like it will produce Kaiju while on the field. First generation, fourth generation only. Clear without a sentinel being immobilized. Maintain a charm the defense rate of 60% or higher. Okay, so only first generation and fourth generation. Then. Okay. That actually doesn't sound too bad for some kind of last resort move. Let's check our skills first, and then we worry about our meta skills. So what do we have available for these guys? Modified Condenser extends the Demolisher's blade range and number of attacks. Ability drops to one third, but attack and speed doubles. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I kind of don't like that, but I do like the hyper condenser. Defense mode also doesn't sound too bad, if I'm honest. I mean, the movement speed drops, but durability quadruples. That makes him quite the tanky dude. Do like the rest of these, though, but how am I going to fit the EMP attractor in? switch that out with the anti-air defense yes so I guess we will upgrade this for him All right, what about him Oh yeah, all right. When attacked, immediately counterattacks all grand ka ground kaiju. Oh heck yeah! I mean, that's that's a pretty good. I mean, that makes him quite tanky. You know, do like me some tanky generation ones. And I mean, these two together just means you can basically drop him into the enemy lines and they will just go ahead and kill everybody around him. Especially if you also put him in defense mode. Yeah, I mean, you know, walk him right into the enemies, activate defense mode and watch him go to town. Gotta be a little bit careful about how I spend my points now because I always spend a lot of points on these two guys. So let's actually check our support. Alright, the interceptors. Oh, she also has that. Also has interceptors. And heat as well. They all have interceptors. Yes, let's first get him some interceptors, and then we can't get that. No! <laughs> no! Why? Okay, what is that? Uh... Yeah, that it releases one more. To get his counter. Yeah, now we'll just get it. Kinda do like leap attack. Because it allows him to get around easier. I kinda don't want to get rid of EMP attractor.
can upgrade maybe one more thing. Or I could just save my stuff. Got our first generation and fourth generation guys up. Clear without essential being immobilized. And maintain terminal defense. Ooh. Oh, you know what I should totally do? Let's actually go ahead and save. Then we'll do that. Oh, we go. That thing looks nice. Win this battle, you must destroy all RPFs. Ah, right, here we go. So, so far they are only down there. We got some molars, which is no problem. Some hunters, okay. Hunters, more molars, workers. It's just that RPF that I don't know what it'll do. So I guess we'll find that out soon enough. So how about releasing some interceptors? Because I want to know what these will do. Actually, all of the... Oh, yeah, he doesn't have some. Now you move into... Oh, wait. I think I will leave A behind. And move in Takatoshi and Ninji. How long does defense mode last? 20 seconds. Oh yeah, listen to that music, man. Things are picking up. Now let's all just move for now. Angie actually moves over there. You can just go in. Wow! Look at that attack range. That is insane, dude. Yeah, 
Oh yeah, he brings the pain now. <laughs> Yes, you can go and check out this guy. Oh, let's just all gang up on this thing. not doing anything. So let's probably just wheel on it. Also, let's maybe deploy... No, let's wait on that. Don't know what will happen once this thing gets destroyed. Starting to be exactly like Horizon Zero Dawn. <laughs> Can I get more of these? Hey, I'm not finished with them yet. Take care of these guys before you drop in more. Oh hell, he wrecks them. Positively just chewing through them. Uh, how about you just drop more of those? Let's recharge after this though. Ninji take care of the rest here. Maybe she can do it. Oh, come on, it's nearly gone. Oh, it is there. Okay. Okay. Fine, fine, fine. Again, I probably could have used the EP on him, actually. Oh, no, no use crying over spilled milk. Oh, 
More. I think it's time to actually do this because we need some decoys. And you guys still need to go over there. I can't use the Marshall Blade, shit. Still just punch them in the face though. Really, really hard. I think I actually need you to take care of the drum rolls. So let's get on it. Jump in place. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I need you all over there. Oh, come on! He's missing one. What? Maybe if he shoots this, he will get enough EP back. I should have probably just defended. Oh, wait, what's happening down there? That's not good. Destroy this before it blows up. Ah, no, 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 no. Come on, destroy it, destroy it, destroy it. Thank God. <sighs> Maybe he can chew through this thing. Really? Come on. Yes! Alright, he's got more for the Marshall Blade now. Okay, where are you? You to get over there. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, not another drum mine. Oh, God. I think you gotta move a little bit closer and then. No, you're the wrong one. Just need you to take that out. Come on, do it. We gotta be careful when advancing on that thing because it could blow up in our faces. Actually, use that. Alter the movement of the mine. That's all I like to see. Now we just wreck its shit. <laughs> that does so much damage. Alright, jump for the win.
Been in the first area. Jing. Oh, look, we took <laughs> the 36 damage. How could we? That all you got? Should we playboy? Okay. Let's do this, Nachan. Tactical analysis. I work alone. Oh, I actually took quite a bit of city damage, but I guess it's okay. Probably was because of all these drum mines exploding. Okay, cool. Miyuki Inaba. Who area has been unlocked? Oh well, story progress 30%. We are at 58, so... Actually not a problem, but let's leave that timing for a little while longer. Alright, I'm starting to feel good about myself again, that we are dealing with these battles so much better because I was a little bit muffed about losing to all these, uh, through this worker horde, if I'm totally honest here. Karaba's memories are being manipulated by Kyuta Shiba through videotapes, but Shiba is quick to wipe his memory whenever he gets too close to the truth. Sorry. Uh, yeah, sure. Because, you know... Only getting an A rank against the horde of workers. <sighs> the 2188 Natsune Minami is Professor Yuki Takamiya's daughter, as well as Keitaro Miura's girlfriend. Keitaro Miura. After shifting to 1985, Miura ends up staying at the Kurabu residence, thanks to Natsune Minami's referral. That same day, Higumi Yakushiji, who happens to be staying there, cooks up some meat he knows only as hamburger. <laughs> Shut him off from his first delicious bite. And the 2188 version? In the 2188 world, Keitaro Miura is an engineer and Natsune Minami's boyfriend. He's also an acquaintance of Professor Yuki Takamiya, Minami's mother. As a history buff, he's particularly fascinated by the Pacific War that occurred 200 years ago. Yuki Takamiya? Professor Yuki Takamiya and the 2188 world is Natsune Minami's mother. She uses her maiden name, Takamiya, as she's already divorced her husband. She feels bad that her daughter, Minami, had to go through the divorce. Alright, what news do we have on Ryoko? Shinemoni discovered Ida's true feelings and motive from watching surveillance footage in the underground facility in 2105. Realizing that Ida is attached only to Chomiki Saragi and has no intention of saving Shinomoni and the others, Shinomoni finally loses a patient and ends up shooting and killing Ida. So much for that. But there's something weird going on with what the AI of the pop idol singer just said, uh, stating that the mainframe is also destroying the colonies. Like, it's not only the Daimos, it's also the colonies. Now, it's just a question of if those two are related. But in the year 2105, when Chihiro, Yuro, and Tsukasa were in the UFO in the mainframe and they, you know, saw the footage of all the Earth crumbling away and dropping down, I guess that had to do with the mainframe, you know? Trying to destroy the colony. Uh, but what has that? What has that to do with the Daimas? Kitushiba, 
an artificial personality for the 8Q that only Kuraba is able to see. Shiba claims that he's Zero Izumi and that his memories are already inside Kuraba's head. In Japanese, 48Q is a play on words of Shiba's name. 4 can be read as she, 8 can be read as Hachi, and Q and Q sound similar. A ah sounds can also be translated as Ba due to the usage of diacritic marks called Dakuten. With this, Shiba Q makes 48Q. QTA CBA also plays on his name. Q plus Ta can be read as Qta, and C plus Ba as Siba. Combining them creates a reading close to his full name. Ah. Yeah, well, gotta play the original Japanese version. Or just play the game in Japanese, I suppose. Mix in the van. Wait. The series target character offers Megumi Yokoshichi a deal. He enters a contract with Yokoshichi, promising he's granted a wish of saving Yuro Kurabi, which carries out a dangerous mission. Miyuki Inaba. So the cat is actually being controlled by that pop singer idol. Or the AI. Well, game, I don't know if that is what you want to show me already now, is it? Because that's a little bit of uh, dropping the gun on stuff. Anyway, what could we unlock? Maybe something about the gate. The place that allows one to shift through time, the coordinates for shifting are set to 40 intervals. The gate in the mainframe can't be controlled without the biometric ID of a compatible individual who possesses nanomachines. Which, apparently, both Tsukasa and um, Chihiro do. Basically, all of the main characters, I want to say. They are compatible. Possess the skeletal structure of a human. Reinforced titanium carbon nanotubes are masked with high-quality silicon skin, making it nearly indistinguishable in appearance from a real human. The battery inside allows it to operate for 120 years before it needs to be recharged. That's a lot of time, man. Okay. I guess it's back from a story. So why don't we go ahead and uh, have another cat call. You catch my meaning here. But yeah, I guess that also definitely reveals to us that the cat is trying to do good. You know, because it's the AI that was just helping us in that battle, or is going to help us in that battle, rather. What's he thinking about? あ、記憶の俺の負けだ。お前にはまだ契約を守る気はあった。重労の頭も Oh, 
ことはだお前は過去の女だなやめてお前のやる気が出る指示をやるよ冬坂伊織は魔法使いだこの子も打って戦場に引き出せ Shoot and drag. Sipo. I guess they're just going to keep coming. We gotta chase the cat then, huh? So there are two cats, huh? Ultimate dilemma, huh? Works as well, right? I mean, bathroom, rooftop. 
What's the freaking difference? I did good. Bamboo. What a fake out. Second area Shibugaki City unlockable. That that city, Shibugaki. Yeah, so we only could have played the battles this far anyway until we have done that. That's interesting. Yeah, I guess we are starting to lock out all the characters here. <laughs> so uh, yeah, why don't we keep going from here? So now we have a cryptic note. <clears throat> Maybe we can finally make sense of that then. Can't make sense of that.
した相手がどんな人物か調べに。DJ, I guess. Yeah. As expected. Options, sure. Let's go find her then. You know, obviously I gotta find it a bit funny that in stories like these, the characters have willingly erased their memories for whatever reason, you know, to protect them or others or whatever. But as soon as they lose their memories, the next thing they're all trying to do is get exactly those memories back again. Basically. 
残念だが何も記憶のこと何か俺から聞いてなかったかもういつもあなたは突然現れてさっと消えちゃうからあでも最後に別れた時何か言いたそうな顔をしてたこのことだったのかもしれない。このメモリー見覚えは見たことない。いおりちゃん。あ、みわちゃん。あ。はあ。な、なに。There she goes again. みわちゃん、落ち着いて。このメモの数字がわかるのかあ、はい、多分教えてくれ先月から始まった電話サービス伝言ダイヤルだと思います電話にメッセージを記録できるやつうん、ママがね仕事で遅くなるときに使ってるのあ、didn't we try it as a telephone number? いおりちゃん、頑張れ。あ、みわちゃん。伝言ダイヤルか。It's pretty sure that we did. のという一年生を知っているか。なっちゃん？なっちゃんなら、A 君が来る前にここで話してたけど。フィルサカさん、クロゲツさん、バイバイ。おいつは、泉十郎。よくしじ。真の処置を受ける男と俺に銃を突きつけた女かやはりあいつ何かある南夏の彼女がユニットを所有しているのかさあ、どれを見I'm just leaving her behind, man. So inconsiderate. I 
人を平気で撃とうとするくせに狙われるのは慣れてないようだな俺を撃つよう俺が頼んだだとどういうことだ私はそう聞かされただけ誰に俺を撃つよう指示された知ってることをしゃべれそれはやめろダメ撃たないで脅かすな死にたいのか重労なんだ君は勝手に上がり込んで思い出したぞ君は時坂神社でロボットを撃った人だ俺は今この女と話してる下がってろ泉十郎泉違う僕は比べ十郎だ邪魔だ十郎スタンガンだ死にはしない説明がまだだ自分で聞けば黒幕はテレビの上よテレビしょうがねえなあ<笑>いや猫がしゃべるはずはないどういう仕組みだ最近は人より猫の方が賢い愚かじゃないのさお前みたいに騎兵を手放してゲームを降りたりはしないからなゲーム怪獣と戦うことがか逃げることばかり考えてたお前がそれじゃダメだと気がついたきっと記録でも見たんだろう記録そう揺るがぬ真実だそれでお前は俺に泣きついたもう一度ゲームにエントリーさせろってな俺がお前を狙ったのはナノマシーンの注入銃だ約束通りお前を戦場に戻してやる逃げるというのはこの世界からの脱出のことかさあな記録というのは何だしっかり忘れて面倒なやつだな<笑>聞いてみろよ後ろのやつにも<笑>貴様何をしてる三浦君関ヶ原<笑>三浦How do they know each other? Huh. Huh? There he is. Go to six. Back in the Sentinels. Isn't he? いや、三浦18番機のリフトにもいたが比べたまを彼女は何者だ未来人なのか18番機の搭乗者だよ18番機兵は AI 操縦のはずだろう
Wait, number 18 can only be piloted by an AI. We're also missing 18 from our lineup, don't we? Yoko said it in motion. Isn't this also the sentinel that BJ is looking for? Because you know BJ is carrying Mira's AI, who we are talking to at the moment. So he wants to go back to the sentinel. Some friends they are. Love and friendship. Yep, I guess I need to lose access to all of them. Oh yeah, we had that fight in the bathroom, right? Yes, 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 yes. Huh? I remember. That's not good.
Anyway guys, I will leave you here for just a moment because I'm just gonna quickly go grab something to drink and then we'll continue on here. Give me just a minute. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Let's continue. Nonde Osanga Koko Dewa Kokoro Motonaina Sono Chimits Kore Moshka Ste Tamosa Ufo de Nanika Saretano Dewa Nare. さんに似てるだけ。隣のクラスにこんな子いたっけ。バイバイエリカ。リグミ。隣のクラス。うん。随分変わった子だね。ですよね。そうだ。先生に報告しとこう。<笑> B 
DJ あの子に正体バレちゃったのあの子今いたじゃない相葉さんここには誰もいないああ What the memory, huh? 部活もうすぐ終わるからね夏のイベント夏今なら黒服いなかったし抜け出せば見つからないかも<笑> Jeez, sorry guys. <clears throat> ダメよ顔を出しちゃう Let's get out of here. Alright, where to now? I mean, we're in the future, we're in the past. Have you been? Sector one, two. Sector one, two, three. Oh, so called Zone Sector two, I see you. Sector two, I saw your mother. Nigger, stay, Nanny Mosaga, say, Nakata, Mon. ちゃんと探してみよう。アクセスコード上に。セクター指定。トライポッドは。ないみたいねでも油断は禁物よさあどうやって探そう Quick. Sure. Tell yourself that. Nanda, Nanda. Kotchi no hold in Nanico Hikotto. There it is.
気平なんじゃない<笑>私が先に見つけてやった置いてったりするからよあビー BJ そんなバラバラだわなんで<笑> BJ、Sorry. 返事をして Oh god, is she stuck in the future again? There actually is a brain in there. Oh, there he is. Yes. Here we go. Here we go. 
Here we go. It isn't there. on a spaceship. So we're in the future. <laughs> Losing control of all of them. Because once it gets interesting, <laughs> you know, the game decides, nope. I'm not going to tell you anymore. Ah. Uh... Uh, actually, I don't know about you guys, but, um, why don't we go ahead and then relieve a bit of stress with another battle? Alright, let's actually go ahead and unlock this. Shibugaki City, Shibugaki City Battle 1, Wave 1. Clear without a sentinel being immobilized, clear within 50 seconds. That actually doesn't sound too bad. Another 30,000 chips to use. Let's maybe go ahead and check. The more kaiju appear, the higher all stats increase. Oh, that's pretty cool. If Minami is in the strike team, weight recovery speed increases. If Ogata is in the strike team, weight recovery speed increases. If Chihiro, contact, if Chihiro contacts the team, increases all stats until the end of the next wave. How do we know when she will do that? Attack increases when traveling the defense rate is 40% or below. Hmm. Increased defense of guardians and sentry guns. Watch your cover speed increase when deployed in consecutive battles. Second rate cover speed increase when no allies are nearby. 
Their goal is to increase temporarily when defeating Kaiju. Oh. Okay. That sounds good as well. Ah, uh, oh, haha. I guess I will take you two. So we need Ogata as well. Fuyuzaka or Yakushiji. Oh, got Yakushiji. Need Ogata though. I guess. Take Ryoko. Maybe let's also take Goto. Many ground kaiju. And her. Okay, got our six sorted out. Uh, I think he's good for now. So what does she bring to the table? I guess I definitely want that. Don't know what else I would take for her though. I'm quite honest. I, mean, I could upgrade this even further. Let's have a look at the ultimate abilities basically of them first. Can also get the fusion cutter. Yeah, let me get that. Also need your interceptors, please and thank you. again. Ah, uh, it'll be okay. Let's definitely upgrade this now. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, not this time. Two consecutive railgun shots. I guess we should increase that then for her. Let's upgrade those. Upgrade his as well. Further increase her sentry guns. Okay. Sure, let's just upgrade those. Okay. Many ground kaiju. Shouldn't be too big of a problem, I suppose. Modified and optimized. They're getting better now. Isn't that wonderful? Place down our defenses. Okay. 
Get you into the battle as well. Yeah, where did those come from? So it doesn't matter too much. Can just do that. Holy fuck, he is a powerful dude now. Okay, something's going to drop down here. Actually, a high quad. Uh, I guess you just stay on the ready for now, but what you can do is deploy more of these. Right, don't we? Just going to charge the key. You just place down more centigans. Alright, you come and move down here, intercept the next wave. Right, charge. Faster. Oh. Okay, we got new enemies on the field. Let's get rid of them. Oh, they are tanky, aren't they? Uh, I think a bit safer doing it this way. Oh, he was overkill. Okay, what's going on over there? It's another high quad. Another high quad. Guys, I need movement. Well, not movement, but you get what I mean. Uh, is that? Yep, that's a grand mine. So what about if we just jump into them, catch them off guard from behind? Gives me a little bit of time to take care of that mine guy. A bit wasteful, but I gotta get rid of the mine. Perfect. Over there. No mines or anything, so let's help Ninji out over here. Yep, shoot all of that. More sentry guns. Always more sentry guns. Can't I hit the both of you? Can. Why don't I do this then? All 
Alright. It's not dying over there. What's this? That's a sentry gun, I suppose. Yeah, I'm okay with that being shot. Alright, dude. I think you should just move over here because I will take care of the left. There's something else. Something like this. Just keep spamming that. Ah! Didn't have enough again. Can punch it though. That will be the last there. Well, I think I actually already dead. You know what? Just charge, dude. I actually don't think I have to do anything else here, but. Get a few EP while I can. The spell is basically on autopilot now. <laughs> good. That's good. But the battle is over. Meta System Sentinel upgrade has been unlocked. Okay. Wow, we took 15 damage. <laughs> this time I'll save you. that win streak bonus. Okay, so you took a bit of damage. I quad. I have nothing too serious I wanna say. Okay, got the bonus objectives as well. Yakitori. Two mystery points. Oh no. Okay, good. That makes me feel good about myself. Always does. It never fails to do so. Still a few things missing here. Escape from the end. Oh yeah, that is when they escape. Have they been down there for a year? Okay. To survive. Ah, eh, so good. And the next one is already when they are attacking that facility. Interesting. 
Yeah, things are starting to come together here. Kisaragi Android. An android that looks like Tumi Kisaragi. It was developed by Tetsuya Ida in 2100. Soon after the AI of the past Kisaragi was transplanted into it, 246 sees his chance to take over the android. Although this was destroyed during the battle against the Tamao Kuraba android in 985, 426 managed to take over the Tamao android's body. Wasn't that just great? The android looks like Tamao Kurabe. It was developed by Tetsuya Ida and Tamao's memories were transplanted into it. During the battle against the Tumiko Zoragi android, 246-985, Tamao's body is taken over by 426. As if we didn't know that. But okay. Oh, I mean, according to the medical records in the nurse's office, Kurabe has been administered NMA8005 and B01. He received four doses of NMA8075, then a fifth dose on was switched to B01, which was created by Tamao Kurabe. I wonder when we'll find out what these things actually do or mean. Ekoshichi enters the contract with Fluffy and uses the magic gun to shoot Renya Goto, Ketaro Miura, Shu Amiguchi, Tomi Kisaragi, and Yori Fuyuzaka. Ekoshichi is the only one who is able to see Fluffy. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Okay. So much for that. Let's get back to the story bit. So, they are all locked behind various things, so why don't we just, you know, continue the trend and lock out Keitaro? <laughs> May 1985, clear skies. As he always does. <laughs> and at least this scene is always the same, at least at the start. Okay, Natsuno Minami will give us more. Kanojo <laughs> That was easy. <clears throat> Let's see how events unfold here. Any tips? Nope. There's Megumi again. Homberger. <laughs> Hem uh, hamburger. Sorry, 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 sorry. Hamburger. What do you want? Again? No. I'm fine. That's right. At this point, I was just eating meat. Oh, I wonder why. Alright, let's search for Natsuno. Hey, there's Ryoko as well. また君か。今日は南いないよ。部活休んで何やってんだか。そうですか。ねえねえ、南さんと付き合ってるの？どこまで進んでるのよ？いや、come on, girl. 
どこに行ったかわかりませんか急ぎの用事らしいけどどこにいるのかは知らないな私知ってます時坂神社に行ってるみたい何しにそこまでは聞いてませんけどこの時代の時坂神社か彼女と出会ったのもあの神社だったな。Alright, let's go. Oh no, there she was. おどろいた。神社はそのままだ。周囲の雑木林は。ずいぶんな様変わりだな。<laughs> I wonder how that would look in the future, actually. Natsuno san wa inai na. Mata kokage ni. Kakrete itari shinai kana. Maybe turn around, dude? Mitsukara na katta ne. Doko ni aru no kana? Natsuno san. どうしたのこんなに遅くこんなところで夏野さん今のはひかりとともに夏野さんが現れた騎兵で時間を飛び越えたあのひかりと同じだそのあのそういえば夏野さんと出会った時も神社で雷のような光を見たそうかここから行き来していたのかどうしよう BJ 隠さず教えてほしい戻りたいのです<笑>時代に Sorry guys そうよ乗ってきたあれどうするのどうしても帰っちゃう。騎兵は後で何とかします。千尋が妹があの後無事だったのか確かめられるなら確かめたい。うん、そうね。BJ お願いできる？ I'm actually going to time travel now. Okay. Oh, time travel. I'm not buying it anymore. She is. Data unit. Minami Natsuno ga motte ita no ka. Ima no de. Modotta no ka. Konna ni tayasuku ikiki dekir to. Hehehe. Sugoi de sho. 自由に時間を行き来できるなら開戦前に騎兵を送ればそれは無理タイムトラベルはきっちり40年単位でしか移動できないのそれにここより過去へはいけないみたいそうか残念だともかく千尋を探そう行こうおそらく避難所か比べの親戚の家にいるはずだ。Yeah, well, it's because, you know, there aren't any other colonies left. That's why I can't travel further back in time or forward in time. 
あれ見て。あの化け物だ。あれは地球を侵略に来た宇宙人の兵器。気平は彼らと戦うための that's why it's not time travel.君には申し訳ないことをした。だが何も心配しなくていい。待って。He's Shifted her to where? Somewhere else on the colony? Oh, you can get, can get Yori back. Oh, we are nearly done with her. We complete her story arc, huh? I mean, maybe there's yet another left after that, but this could be the last one for her, actually. Exciting. Oh, not again. レコード買いに行くの付き合ってくれたり最近なんだか私に気を使ってるみたいおぞおそんなことないよ美穂子のことだからほらなんかいい店見つけたのかなってうん本当にいいの私が決めて本当にいいの I wouldn't be. Iori-san, 
ちゃんは何が食べたいのそれは食べてのお楽しみ。Master of the meal. Do they eat it, the stick along with uh, the other stuff? Kind of did. You have no idea. Kore ga kiken na koi da toshite mo. Kono kimochi tomerare nai. Iori. Oh, look who's there. Uso! Sekigahara kun? Issho ni koi. Eh? Demo. Sekigahara anta. Nande Iori ni chikazuita no? Kisaragi Tomika. That handshake, <laughs> so adorable. Mada Yume or Mirinoka. ええ。それは幼稚部なんかじゃない。森村千尋の記憶だ。森村先生の彼女の記憶を移植されているんだ。まさか未来の技術ならそれが可能だ。森村先生は未来の人ってこと。そうだ。夢で見た通りだよ。じゃあ、アミグチ君やクラベ君も。クラベ。玉尾さんを知っているのか。玉尾？うん。クラスのクラベ十郎君。十郎。なるほどな。でもどうして私に？おそらく。
Confession. Ooh. Hey there, Ramza. I went to sleep yesterday with your stream on. How would my browser this tab still open and you are streaming again? <laughs> yeah, well, you know, I just can't stop playing this game. I mean, I actually was trying to sleep last night. Uh, I can't even remember if I slept at all because I just couldn't stop thinking about this game and you know I did announce that I would play today and I will also play tomorrow but trying until now I failed well I'll come back to the stream then I guess <laughs> I mean you may need uh, to be uh, at the height of your capability brain wise I guess to understand what's going on here but we are trying Or maybe it will just, you know, overload your brain so much that you will involuntarily fall into sleep. I think we really what is that? Well, ask the characters in the game here. They can definitely tell you. Next time, huh? Actually, that got me thinking. Like, you know, normally with the gate, they can only travel 40 years into the past into the future. However, both Ida and apparently A have managed to do 16 year jumps. How is that actually possible? Nine, 
みんなを守って戦うどう戦う気だ<笑>重郎は何もかも忘れてるがあいつならきっと一緒に戦ってくれる比べ君エイ君は戦わないの俺と涼子さんにはもう時間がないここを去るそう俺はこういうやつだ好きになる価値のない男さお前もこれで目が覚めたろ How can she be? Can she be here, though? I thought she's dead. Oh no, there she is. Hello, future self. This is gonna be good. Watashi no miru yume ga sensei no kiyoku to yu no wa honto nan desu ka? Naze sonna koto o? Iitaku nai nara ore kara iyo ka? Fuyusaka ni kiyoku to jinkaku o uwagaki shite. ふゆさかをあんた自身に変えようとしていた。え？成り代わろうとしてたんだ。わかった。説明する。その積もりだった。でも今はそんな気はない。なぜだ。もういい実作戦しかないからよ。教えて先生。私は。どうなるの人格を変える段階までは進んでないあなたはあなたのままよただ私の記憶を持ってるだけそれも重郎に邪魔されてあなたは夢のようにしか思ってないけど夢の中のクラベか426だやつも移植していたのか違うわ今の彼じゃないあんな風に変わる前の泉くんに戻したかった記憶のおかげでわかる彼を思う先生の気持ち<笑>それで比べたまおにも記憶移植を違うね本当の目的を教えろ先生の気持ちは本当だよ。比べたまおと網口州に記憶移植したのは。彼らとの約束だったからよ。適合者でなければならない何かがある。俺はそれを知るために。あんたをここに呼んだんだ。じゃあ、まあ、私コンパティブルツー。なぜだ。なつニュース。私はもう。人間ではないの。リセットが起こった時に私がいた世界が制圧された時に本当の私は死んでいるじゃあエンアンドロイドユニバーサルコントロールが作り出した幻エンイルージョン先生が幻まさかどういうことだセクターゼロへ転移すれば次の世界へ脱出できるんじゃないのかリセットを超える方法なんて本当はないのよセクターゼロへの転移は転移じゃない私をスキャンしてデータを取るだけそしてユニバーサルコントロールの一部として次の世界でそのデータが再生される
それがループの正体か15人の人間だけが計画を完遂できる計画主を存続させるための2188年の計画だけど私はもうこの5つのセクターにとらわれる人形でその使命を果たせない人間としてこの世界に生まれた自分つまり冬坂いおりになろうとしていたわけだもう一度人間に戻るために関ヶ原君もセクターゼロへ転移する気だったのねああイージス作戦も止めるつもりだったあんたを殺してなここで打つ気なの I mean how can you shoot a oh not an illusion but what s h e call the projection? ユニバーサルコントロールを隔離してあんたは存在できるのかセクターゼロにあるデータは隔離されても機能するつまりあんたは生き残れる人間じゃないけどなそしてはっきりした涼子さんと俺には逃げ道なんてなかったってことが。There's another clone. How did she get a possession of that? でもない
森村の言うことより自分を信じろあっ玲子玲子の言う通り今の自分を信じる美和ちゃんやお父さんお母さんたちみんなを守る資格が私にあるなら私は無敵の女子高生は今どきロボットにだって乗っちゃうんだから<笑> well, she's not wrong. To the final battle. All right, cleared her. The invincible schoolgirl. All right, yeah, it's all from her. Cool. Cleared our first character. Ah. So much stuff locked now, though. Why don't we go ahead and uh, have another one of these? Shibugaki City Battle 2, Wave 2. There you go. Port of Aerial Hunter Kaiju. Toilet Sentinel upgrades. Sentinel upgrades have been added to the customized screen. Enhance your Sentinels by using meta chips. Press triangle to open the customized screen. Use the select Sentinel upgrades and press X to upgrade. Okay, so we can do that as well, huh? But first, let's have a save. City defense at a time of clearing 80% or higher. Maintain a terminal defense rate of 70% or higher. All then. I guess I will take you. Let's actually have a look at this Sentinel upgrade stuff. Armor. Sentinel upgrade armor. Enhance the Sentinel's armor, HP, defense, and its attention to nullify attack. Generator. Enhance EP up, attack up, and increases EP recovery. Attack accuracy increases critical damage. Actuator speed and defense up, increases move speed and distance, and neural link. Decreases brain overload. That sounds useful. Well. Yeah, who are we going to take? Actually, what are the new pilot skills? Karabis and strike team increase all stats. Too bad she can't be. Okay, she needs Natsune. And if we have her, we might as well take Kitaro. Maybe take Takatoshi as well for the EMP. And then maybe Ryoko again.
Yeah, I think I feel good about that team. Okay. First, give him interceptors, yes, and please. Give him... All oh, right, he already has that. Yeah, she needs that. One of the Sentinel. Homing missile. Entire air bombardment. Sound too bad. Let's actually upgrade that to have him get around a little bit easier, I suppose. Let's give her that just in case. This sounds also cool. Yeah, it's definitely to give her that. It makes it a little bit safer for her to, you know, get into the fray. I guess healing could be good, but... Eh. I just want to increase the interceptors. This is starting to look good. I'm starting to like the look of that. Uh, 
now. City defense rate and terminal defense rate. Let's do this. First of all, it's the ability to deploy interceptors. Because that is what we do around here. Deploy a whole lot of support shit. For you to get in. Oh, they are fast. Crap. They are out of commission. They are about to come in. So many flyers. I mean, it's to be expected they said that a horde of flyers was about to come in. Look at all that stuff. I brought him, I guess. That to me, game. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna do that. That buys me a little bit of time.
Of course there's more. Now let's start a little bit of a cleanup duty here. Still hit that thing. You can. can do it. Where did these come from? Oh boy. Take these out. Yeah, we're gonna take. We're gonna need something like that to take the rest of them out. Just not gonna use that then. They survived that. Okay. These guys be tanky. Oh wait, I think they're shielded. Yeah, they are. Is there an app sauce nearby? Seeing it. Eh, no matter. Need to drop that thing. Guys, nice. I think it's actually the last enemy left. was the last one. That's in took a bit of damage. Okino support. Not that yet. Oh, I hope so. Ooh. 
Oh no! What? When did the terminal get bit up like that? Alright, you know what? I am not gonna stand for that. Let's do this. So, city defense rage, terminal defense rage. So, I guess I'll take you guys. He needs interceptors. Them. Same with her, and let's give her the composite ceramic armor of it, definitely. She needs. We could upgrade that. Don't know what for, but why not? I actually, get the appear tractor. I should bring these. Maybe get that, because we are going to face a horde. Hey, right, actually, let's take a look at that. Increases HP defense, EP attack, attack accuracy, speech defense. Oh, hey there, watchdog! As you do it, reassemble a laptop. Why did you have to reassemble a laptop? I really want to get that, but I don't think we have enough points to do so. So let's stick to other stuff. I don't know, man. I'm never going to use stun knuckles with her. Okay. I think I really do need more interceptors. My brother took it apart a few months ago and got a new cable for it that buggered off, so I had to make it again. <laughs> well, shit. I mean, but if you got it working, I mean, that's good, right? What else do I need here? Yeah, 
could upgrade that. And maybe give him the flare torpedo. Receptors. Just want to rely on them. You know, let's get that and try it out instead of defense mode. I'm curious. Okay, with that, let's deploy. Basic for the win. Okay, let's get to the destruction then. First, let's drop some defenses and shit. Drop all of them to the ground. Nice. So many flyers. So can I have more interceptors, please?
All right, at that point then. Yep, it's definitely time to do this. these guys. Okay, more of them. And then yet more. Please. Good thing I had two. Over here, flyers, lots of flyers. They are really tanky. Like, unbelievably so. Okay, we got a few stragglers up there. I mean, bulk is down here. Give me a few more of those. Okay, that's been taken care of.
I don't need to pick guy left now. No problem. Punch him real good. Alright. That looked good. Those EMP pulses really did some work here. Okay, let's see that. Uh, yeah, I took a bit of damage there. Kino support. Not dead yet. Damage, but nothing too major, I guess. Fourth generation Sentinels. I guess the city took so much damage because I was dropping these flying kaiju left and right. Alright, got the bonus objective as well. In a Lokitor. And two more mystery points for us to use. Not yet, thank you. Uh, Alright guys, um, we've been going on for quite another while here, uh, you know, it's actually getting kind of late, so I am of a mind to end this stream here, um, I will be continue playing this tomorrow, um, I'll probably start even a little bit sooner than today, so at the moment I'm thinking between, you know, 10 to 11 a.m., something like that. And then we have another whole day of this game for us. Which I'm already looking forward to because, you know, we are starting to get a little bit closer to the end. You are getting closer to the truth here, and I want to see it. Um, so, yeah. Thank you guys so much for coming by today. I mean, it is the weekend. You know, what even are you doing here, I suppose? <laughs> Definitely appreciate it nonetheless. And, uh, is there any, actually anybody who I can send you off to? Yes, there is. So I will send you guys over to Poliswax. He is playing a little bit of Mario Kart. Maybe with some friends or something. I guess we will find out about that in just a moment. So yeah, guys. Thank you so much for coming by. Watching me play 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. Uh, it's always, it has been a lot of fun. I'm really digging this game, if you couldn't tell already. And, uh, I hope to see you tomorrow. And if not, then, you know, on Monday at the usual time. We will also be continuing playing this game, because I don't think we will get through it tomorrow. Anyway, guys, see you then. Bye-bye. <laughs>